Good morning and welcome to worship with Plymouth Presbyterian Church on this first Sunday of Lent. Welcome to worship. This morning, the session of the church has called our annual congregational meeting to be held today on February 21st at 10.30 a.m. on the Zoom service. Uh, if you have not gotten the email link for that, please email me. I'll be in front of my computer the, on Sunday morning in the lead up to 10.30, so you can email me. I'll get that Zoom link to you. You can also call me or Melody Baker uh, to be looped in on, uh, on audio as well. This meeting will be held over Zoom, um, but if you'd like to call in with your regular phone, that is possible, as is any device that can get this video that you're watching right now can probably also get uh, the Zoom uh, meeting to be held in that annual meeting. That annual meeting is, will be held for the purposes of electing officers, approving clergy terms of call, and thanking outgoing officers. As we turn to worship in this Lenten time, uh, in scripture it says that God is present wherever two or more are gathered. And we do that in spirit as well as in physical presence with one another. So as we gather, I invite you to take a deep breath in and out as we turn to God in worship. Please join me in the call to confession, or in the, in the prayer of confession. Let us confess our sins before God, our help in times of trouble. Let us pray. God of mercy, we begin this Lenten season in confession. We do not live according to your ways, but according to our own. We condone violence, participate in systems of injustice, and use power to our own advantage at the expense of others. Forgive us, we pray, when we are tempted to follow paths other than those you set before us. Teach us your commandments. Help us to turn from evil in its many guises and turn us toward your kingdom drawing near. Amen. Friends, in the waters of baptism, we are brought to Christ in new life. This is the good news of the gospel. In Jesus Christ, we are forgiven. Thanks be to God. The peace of Christ be with you. I invite you to, in the week to come, not necessarily right now, to reach out to one another in peace, to share the peace of Christ with those in your lives. The peace of Christ be with you. Amen. <laughs>